This weekend you've joined us at Busfest. It is the largest VW transporter show in the world. We are at the Three County Showground among the Malvern Hills. Busfest has been going since 1994. Uh, it first started off as Bangfest, which is what I knew it as, as about a 15 year old kid. Started going with my dad and a couple of years later he bought his first split screen camper van. There's plenty of companies that offer carpets, pop top roofs, uh, conversion companies that will do the whole job for you. Or if you're looking for a specific part or replacement, especially for your older Volkswagen, you'll probably find it there. My favourite thing this year that I saw was a TP awning that came off the side of your van. It was so cool, it had a log burner in it and it had been really furnished to a really beautiful standard. Really nice mats um, and just soft furnishings in it, it was really nice to see. Uh, we've just had breakfast. Breakfast. And it, the, as we were about to wash up, which <gasps> I love washing up, it starts to rain. So not that on the head. Back in the van, having a tidy up, and we're about to head out and see what it's all about. Got the Packamac on. So have you. Yeah, we're <laughs> heading. His and hers, Packamac. Yeah, they're extremely fetching articles of clothing, aren't they? So we're heading out now. <laughs> it's my worse than the portaloos. gonna get wet in a minute. <laughs> Was it about the third shower so far? Yeah. They're heavy. <laughs> go and stand in front and go, I want one of these one day. Hey, go on. Say it. How are you feeling so far, Buzzfest 2017? Would you like to see what we've bought? Yeah. This is the part-time table mechanism. We're gonna make our own bespoke table and the table will go onto that out and then to keep it up oh the suspense is good <laughs> hey. adjustable leg height adjustment and then we've also made another purchase and um, this looks really nice when it's on package and it's got the blues of the van with combined with the yellow so we're really going to town on the um, aesthetics of this mat we're happy so far we're having lunch now and it's actually stopped raining could really work <laughs> Super accident. What happened there, kid? Decided it was a good idea to lift the table in because it started to rain and the whole shoe fell off. It's Saturday night and we're still at Buzzfest. I'm making tea. Yeah, Meg's starting to make tea. We've had a good day shopping and uh, we've got a few ideas of stuff we want to do. Tomorrow we shall complete our shopping for the week. Complete the purchases. Yeah, and we'll have a lot to do once we get home. Day three, it's Sunday. We've had breakfast. The weather hasn't really got any better, has it? Still very much overcast. Uh, we had an issue yesterday with the soup. We haven't had any more off of that, thank the thank <laughs> Lord. But uh, yeah, we kind of chilled last night. Really didn't get that much involved with uh, the nighttime entertainment. We still watched a film on the old pad. But today's our last chance of getting a few little bits of bobs. So we're going to go hit the stalls, have a look what's going on, and try and make a speedy escape before it gets too, too busy, too busy, and wet. We're gonna get one over my T4. <laughs> we just got back from Bus Fest. We've had a really nice time. We may need to do an apology. Yeah, more me than Meg, I think. Um, it's got nothing to do with me. I'm I was oblivious to it all. Somebody might have recognised us, but spoke to you. If you do watch these videos, I'm, I'm sorry we didn't stick around to talk. Hopefully you're watching. If you are, please comment and let us know. I we know. want to say sorry because, because... shortly after, we got out the hall and I asked Meg if she'd been speaking to someone about our, our vlogging and she said, not really, no. And then it clicked to me what he'd, what he'd said to me. What happened, Meg took the bars back on the little golf buggy by herself. As you will have seen. And I went back into the hall to try and find this chap. 
and I put a little tweet out as well actually just to see maybe if that would have helped I am so sorry and maybe we'll see you next year but it wasn't intentional I'm not that blunt usually as a person but I had a lot going on I know it's no excuse really but I do apologize anyway that was Buzzfest 2017 and my apology um, I will make it up to you we'll buy you a pint how about yes. that yeah